Brooks Parsha with a really serious episode when a guy is so poor, he's so poor that he has to hawk, he has to sell his, his night clothes. All he has is one set of day clothes. He can't go in the unclothed in the street. But his nightgown that he sleeps in, he's so poor, he has to sell it, he has to hawk it. He pawns it to buy a piece of bread. So the Torah says that if he has to pawn his nightgown, then at night, the pawnbroker has to give it back to him so he can sleep in it. And now he goes to the pawnbroker, give me back my nightgown. The pawnbroker says, no, you can't have it. I'm going to lose my collateral. He would have it. So the guy, he's got nothing left. And he screams out to Hashem. And he says, Hashem, I can't take this poverty anymore. I'm so destitute. And Hashem says, And it came to pass that I'll hear his voice. And I will listen. I'll listen to the call because I am forgiving. Well, wait a second, what's he talking about? Listen to his voice, it should be a listen to his voice. I'm compassionate, I'm at home. But the Torah says, Hanun, why forgive me? And why the Haya? That's a happy thing. He said, Fayahi, which is unhappy. So what's the good news about this guy being so destitute? The good news is that his whole life, he never talked to Hashem. He never called out to Hashem. So now finally, he's calling out to Hashem. And this is the whole, this is the epitome of good in the world when someone calls out to Hashem and establishes a relationship to the Hashem. So don't wait until you're poor and down and out. Do it while things are good. But ultimately, we get to close to Hashem. This is the good news in this world. That's this week's Parsha.